The 10 at 10 with Amy Johnson starts right now. Now at 10, another World Series championship for the Dodgers. We've got a recap of their epic win against the Yankees. Plus, the celebration continues. We've got details on a massive victory parade tomorrow for our boys in blue. And do you have your merch yet? Our Amanda Starantino is live as Dodgers fans rush to grab some championship gear. This is KCAL News Mornings. Hello and welcome to the 10 at 10. I'm Amy Johnson. Here are some of the other stories that we're tracking for you this Thursday, October 31st. Story number four, Freddie Freeman comes home and MVP. We're going to hear more about the Dodgers superstar from a former coach and get ready for a Halloween adventure on the high seas or right in the heart of Tito Hills. We've got more spooky house displays to show you in our story number six. And then story number seven, frightful fiction fans materialize. We're going to look at the rise of horror book clubs and why more people are reaching for scary reads. But first, let's check in with our meteorologist, Amber Lee, joins us now with your next weather forecast. And Amber, I am a big chicken of those scary books, but I'm loving the weather. Oh, I love scary movies and I love the weather. So I love it all. It's such a great day uh, to be here in Southern California, to be a Dodger fan as well. Take a look at our Mount Wilson camera. It is clear. We get to zoom in right over Dodger Stadium. Temperatures this morning a little bit chilly, not quite as cold as yesterday, but we're still faring out much cooler than normal, especially for this time of year. So we do have temperatures currently nice and mild in the 60s for Pasadena, for Burbank. We still have some low 50s for Santa Clarita, 63 for Fullerton and mid 60s for LAX. But if you want to compare to temperatures to this time yesterday, we're a little bit warmer and you can see why we're up by 14 degrees up in the mountains for Big Bear because we're not as cold. Remember yesterday we had those frost advisories for the Antelope Valley. Now we're up by 10 to 16 degrees and then we're up by three degrees for Burbank, two for Riverside, seven for San Bernardino. As we head into the afternoon for Halloween, we are dealing with some dry but cooler weather, especially for this time of year. And you can see temperatures are going to stay below average 72 for the coast 75 for LA and Orange County. We have upper 70s for the valleys, low 70s for the Inland Empire, upper 60s for the high deserts, mid 50s for the mountains. Coming up my next weather forecast, I will have your trick or treat forecast and I'll also tell you about our next chance of rain and mountain snow. Amy. Now you can get your KCAL news, weather and live stream all in one place on the CBS News app. Download it free today.